This video, I'm going to be breaking down the best blitz in College Football 25, and this actually is probably the best blitz in the game. This blitz is insanely fast. It's going to come in super fast, and it's going to basically force a max protect, and even if they do max protect, oftentimes the blitz will still come in. So what we're going to do is we're going to be in the 4-3 even 6-1 formation. This is in the 4-3 multiple defensive playbook. We're going to put our auto flip off. If you want to get my full breakdown on this defense, I'll put it in, put it in, uh, I'll put a link to my school community. They, they already have access to this. The school community gives you access to all of my full offensive defensive breakdowns. You guys want to get access to that. It's got full eBooks in there, uh, blitz breakdowns, money plays, everything you need to be successful. The link to sign up for the school page is in the description below for just $10. You'll be able to get access to all of our college and Madden content. So Sam will blitz. How we're going to run this play is we are simply going to basically we're going to shift our defensive line. And you can kind of do a couple different trains of thought here. What I like to do is I like to shift my defensive line uh, to whichever side I want the blitz to come in on like the most. So like here we're going to shift to the to the right and we're going to crash. Um, we're going to crash to the right. So you see this it kind of looks like this. And what you'll see is the snap of the ball. We're going to absolutely scream at the quarterback. Now, another way to get this blitz to come in is to shift to the right and stand in this A gap like this. This time we'll probably see the double pressure. And we get that double pressure. This is what makes this defense super good. If they send five out, you should get two people free from somewhere. Um, sometimes it comes up the A gap. Sometimes it comes off the edge. Sometimes it comes through the B gap. This game's a little inconsistent, so just kind of know that. But again, just shift right. I would probably stand. One of my, I've kind of ex been experimenting with standing over this, over the, over the, over this DT. The reason being is sometimes it can trigger an A gap. It didn't do it right there, but sometimes it can trigger an A gap from the uh, right side guy. But the cool part about the Sin Six is that if they block their running back, you're going to see here that this blitz will still scream every single time. So if they block their running back, you're always going to get pressure. If they block their tight end, that's probably the best chance they have at actually picking up the blitz. But sometimes this will trigger an A-gap or the left side pressure. Now, the cool part with this scheme, you can also send uh, – so like, let's say that you notice they're blocking their tight end a lot. All you have to do is just simply crash to the side opposite the tight end, and now you're going to see that we get some kind of disengage, B-gap, A-gap pressure against that look right this defense is a lot of fun to run um, if you have had trouble getting stops in this game i highly doubt you're going to have trouble after running this defense if you want to learn the entire system and why this defense is as good as it is and how to truly optimize this blitz make sure you join the school community school.com slash cody ballard the link to sign up is in the description below